What's going on guys? Today I'm here to talk to you guys about how to do a muscle up. We'll start with here. Start right here and hang down. You're gonna lift yourself up like that. Come all the way down. See that? Oh, that one I couldn't do too well. Um, anyways, that's not really why I'm here with you guys today. Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about getting out there and going outside and going to take a walk. Um, some forward ambulation, if you will. Now, there are a lot of things you can do with a day well there's a lot of things you can do in a day and especially if you live in a dwelling and you are a you know kind of a domestic person um days can pass by like and that can turn into weeks and you could just be in your house the whole time um, and you can spend years like that. Uh, but I'm here to tell you guys that, uh, you can go outside and do some, uh, and that's not to say that you're not being, let's say, productive inside. You could be very productive inside. But let's, let's kind of think the idea of productivity. And if you're working inside, let's say, and you got, let's say, online business or something that you can kind of, you can kind of say that it's productive for you to be inside. Um, and that's cool. Um, I'm trying to balance this thing on a thing. Let's see. Um, anyways. Um, yeah, and it's cool. But the thing is... And you are being productive. But your life... Like, days will go by and there's more to life than just being inside and uh, being quote unquote productive inside because there's other things you can do. And that's not to say that being outside is more productive or less productive. But um, get, just getting out there, especially if you are someone that lives in a condo, apartment, home, residential dwelling, um, it will kind of take its toll on you if you stay inside all the time. Because inside is a human-made concept, if you think about that. Inside is a concept that was created by humans. There is no inside for animals or nature. Um, I guess there's caves and stuff where you could be in a cave. But, and let's say like groundhogs can be inside their little burrow. But it's not really technically inside, like they don't have a door. Um, and so with inside being a human concept, it's, it's a little bit a distance from the natural world. And I think 
the more natural or naturalist you are, the better. Now that can be misconstrued or gone to the extreme, which honestly I think is fine. Um, yeah, I think that's totally cool. But if you are inside too much, you'll get lost, lost in your mind. And it's good to, it's good for your mental health to go outside and do things and let's say run errands even outside because as humans I think we're naturally in inclined to be out go see some trees even if they're not as great as the redwoods <laughs> a little slight jab to uh, Florida but um yeah, I think it's, it is important to be outside, and that's all I have to say about that. Now, on to the next part of the video. Um, we're going to go ahead and try to do another muscle up. Let's see if this will stay there. All right, here we go. Ah. No, that was a little bit off. Yep, that was good form. That was a good form right there. Yep, good form. You gotta maintain the good form. And, uh, and I will leave you guys with this. What is the underlying form? <laughs>